undetected footprints, we are talking about 21-year-old Caleb Harris. He went missing March 4th, 2024 from Corpus Christi, Texas. This is going on the fourth week. The fourth week since he disappeared. He is a Texas A&M college student. He hasn't been seen since just around 3 a.m. outside his apartment complex called the Cottages on North Pedre Island. His family told Fox News that they received Snapchats from Caleb about 2.45 a.m. when he went to take his new dog for a walk. The family then says that he put the dog back inside the apartment and went outside to wait for Uber Eats order to arrive. The Uber Eats delivery was marked as completed, said the family. Corpus Christi said that Caleb left behind his keys, his wallet, and his vehicle. They say he did have his cell phone on him, but is now turned off. Crews have searched include the east and south parts of North Pedre, including spots behind the apartment complex. Hundreds of volunteers are part of the search, helping police in the U.S. Coast Guard. Caleb's dad, Randy Harris, says he kind of vanished. There's no evidence of wrongdoing. But there's no evidence at all. And so it's a matter of looking at every inch. Everything could possibly think of. It is a mystery. We just need to find Caleb. He's out there. And we know how we know he's out there. It's just finding out where he is and what happened to him. Y'all, Caleb just walked outside, standing around waiting for his food to get there. And he literally vanished without a trace. Up next is a ring doorbell camera. Appeared to have recorded the missing teen and his two of his friends outside on the night he vanished while they were walking the dog. Let's take a look. Academy continuing our coverage this Friday night into the urgent search for Caleb Harris. Tonight we're reviewing new video of the Island University student appearing to be from the last night that he was seen a ring camera capturing some of his last movements before his mysterious disappearance. So take a look here. Caleb can be seen in the parking lot at his off campus apartment complex off of Ennis Jocelyn around 1 a.m. He was with one of his roommates, a friend outside playing with a dog. Caleb's face visible as he looked toward the ring camera before they make their way back in the other direction on that night in early March. Here's a video speaking about the GoFundMe page they have for Caleb Harris. Let's watch. Well, we now enter week four into the search for Caleb Harris. The 21-year-old disappeared on March 4th, last seen at his off-campus apartment complex on Ennis Jocelyn. A GoFundMe set up to help the family with expenses as they continue searching for Caleb has now raised over $59,000. Up next is a news video talking about Caleb's disappearance, and they are speaking with Caleb's father. Let's take a look. I'm Alexis Scott, your neighborhood news reporter in the Bay Area near Rodfield Road. We've been keeping track of the search to find 21 year old Caleb Harris since he vanished more than a week ago. And this is one of the many places where law enforcement searched to find him. I spoke with his father as he explains his last conversation with his son before his disappearance. For the past 11 days, the Harris family has been full of worry and concern since they first found out about Caleb's disappearance. It's a parent's worst nightmare. You know, you, where's your where's your children? Randy Harris, Caleb's father, says he spoke with him the night before he vanished and everything was fine. Hours later is when he received the news from his wife. The roommate had just called and said he was missing. And they couldn't find him. So my wife got the call and then she called me and I immediately came down here. His father tells me the sequence in which Caleb disappeared seems odd. He stayed in contact with his family often and even had upcoming plans with friends. So Randy claims something isn't adding up. It's, it's his intentions. I mean, texting us, Snapchatting his friends. They, they had just gotten a new dog that evening and uh, signed the lease on his apartment. 
uh, for next year. Law enforcement agencies have been working nonstop using local and statewide resources to find him. Friends have also joined in on the search, creating Facebook pages aimed at finding him. It gives people a place to go and, and, and look and then and share, share the good stuff. Originally from New Braunfels, the 21-year-old came to Corpus Christi to study environmental science at TAM UCC. Randy says Caleb's dream is to work outdoors as a Texas game warden or an environmental lawyer. Just smiling all the time, uh, loves to play guitar. Describing his son as a good person. He's the kind of kind of person that, you know, if there's somebody's got a flat tire or whatever, he's going to stop and do whatever he can to help them. As the search continues to find Caleb. We just pray for patience and for um, the, the stamina to con continue just anything and everything we can. His father is asking one thing from the community. I'm just thankful for the, the support that we have and going forward just continue to be vigilant, continue to be uh, steadfast. Randy says the family will continue to lean on their faith and have hope in finding Caleb safely. If you know any details about where Caleb may be, you're asked to call Corpus Christi Police. Let's everyone pray that Caleb Harris can be found safe and return to his parents. Hopefully more searches go on, more people get involved so that the family can find out where he is and what happened to him.